This is lesson 4 of how to edit a Hammond XK3 organ. In this lesson I would like to discuss the tube amplifier. Quite an innovation really, building vacuum tubes into a digital organ, but it's very useful. The organ contains two small preamp tubes. One is a 12AX7, or in English an ECC83, and the other one is a 12AU7, or an ECC82. Both these are very popular preamp valves in many amplifiers and indeed many Hammond organs. Both of these tubes have their benefits. They have different tonal characteristics. If you press the tube amp button on the front panel and then turn the knob from minimum to maximum, you will hear that the distortion increases. When the light below the tube knob is green, that's just using the preamplifier as a tube preamp. As you turn the tube amp knob clockwise, the light will change from green to amber and then to red. Red is a lot of distortion. It's great to have distortion at your fingertips without damaging your loudspeakers. To access the parameters, you go into the control panel, press the menu button, and cursor up until you see OD stroke VIB. It's the OD that we want in this case, as OD stands for overdrive. The first of the controls is the drive to the overdrive, self-explanatory. The higher the number, the more overdrive. The second one is blend. This is a blend between bass and treble. And the next one, EXP, puts the expression pedal before the overdrive or vice versa. I would recommend that you just leave this expression pedal first before overdrive. That way it follows the natural order of things. There are no hard and fast rules about setting the overdrive parameters. Just fiddle with the controls until you get the thing to sound how you want it to. If you then cursor across again to the preamp, it gives you the type of valve layout. This is what I would generally use, dual two, with a crossover of 800 cycles. 800 cycles is a Leslie crossover, no other reason. It just seems to give a good sound. You don't need to go mad with the settings on the overdrive, not unless you want to play with John Lord's other organ sound all the time, but it's very useful in small degrees for most things. It just gives the organ a more valvey feel. Thanks for watching. I hope you found it useful.